Picture this. You're watching someone fling paint at a canvas with their eyes closed, claiming they're not painting, they're just feeling the art. Now replace the canvas with a code editor and the paint with half-baked AI prompts. And congratulations, you've just discovered what some people are calling wipe coding. Yes, this is real, somehow. Now recently, some tech evangelists who apparently ran out of real problems to solve have been raving about this mystical process of just wiping with the AI to build software. No specs, no diagrams, and no responsibilities. Just wipes. Magical, right? Well, let's pump the brakes before we crown this as the future of engineering. You see, there's a massive difference between making code exist and engineering software that survives reality. Coding is telling the computer what to do right now. Engineering is preparing it for what the world will throw at it next week, next year, and basically forever because users never ever let things die peacefully. Now here's a secret. Software engineering isn't about slapping together a few lines of code and shipping it while the dopamine is still warm. It's about building digital infrastructure that doesn't collapse the second it faces actual human usage. Things like maintainability, security, scalability, you know, those annoying words that vibe coders tend to treat like they're optional. When you vibe code into existence, sure, you might get a prototype that looks flashy in a demo, great for raising seed rounds, but not so great when production traffic turns your clever prompt into a very expensive bonfire. See, the messy truth is that engineering lives in the ugly details, such as who's patching vulnerabilities at 3am, or what happens when the user data needs migrating, or how will this system handle spikes in traffic, or let's be honest, your inevitable feature bloat. AI is a useful tool, absolutely, but treating it like a replacement for engineering rigor is like assuming a microwave is a 5-star chef. It will heat your leftovers, sure, but it will not win you a Michelin star. So no, there's no such thing as vibe engineering. There's just engineering with all its boring, necessary, deeply unglamorous responsibilities. If you want to vibe, by all means, vibe. But if you want your software to live longer than your caffeine rush, you're going to have to do the real work. Welcome to reality, where we have bugs.